Hey guys, and welcome to the channel. Today we're going to be talking about a mobile game that I recently downloaded and a new champion that is coming out today, actually within the next 30 or so minutes of when I'm recording this. So this is Red Gauther. Now Red Gauther, uh, based on everything that I've been able to find, watch, and try out, is probably the number one support champion in the entire game. And we're going to go over why the reason that is. So the very first thing that we're going to notice here is that we have his basic attack skills, which at first glance is nothing game changing, right? We're going to be inflicting damage equal to 120% of the attack on all enemies. He can disable attack skills, which is nice, right? It's still going to leave um, them with their debuff skills. Um, the other thing to notice is that it's going to change um, when you are upgrading it to silver or the two star. Now the second thing that we're gonna be talking about is the most important part about this character. And it's the fact that he can increase the skill ranks of your cards that you are holding, which means that if you are holding a green king, for example, you're gonna be able to petrify your opponents. It's just gonna increase all of your leveling as if you had given, um, had combined two cards of that same type which is absolutely astonishing. This is gonna be something that we are gonna be seeing in PVP constantly. So this is a absolute must have champion. It's gonna go so well with so many other characters um, and it's gonna change, it definitely gonna change the global um, usage of the game. So just a couple examples about how broken this could potentially mean for your teams is for instance, some of these S and A tier uh, characters, such as Royal Sword, going from affecting one ally to affecting all ally, uh, Bond, going from life stealing, or not even life stealing, uh, doing 150 damage and uh, getting his life steal uh, for the entire uh, team, increasing his extortion. Um, like we said before, King getting the Petrify, which meaning every single time you attack with King, you could potentially be Petrifying, or even more for multiple turns if you are already being able to upgrade him. Um, that would also mean that he would be able to turn into a better healer as well. And that would leave out a slot for your healer. So Gother could essentially take the slot of a, a full-time healer on that. Merlin gets a massive bonus here. Um, she goes from doing 120% to 300% uh, attack. Um, she also gets a massive boost in her barrier as well, and this is just a couple, not even of the main champions that are going to be affected in the future by this. So that is by far the biggest increase. Um, there's nothing really downside about having Gauther on your team. There's only an upside really. The third thing that we're going to be checking out here is Rewrite Light, which is going to inflict AOE damage of 350% on all of the opponent's characters and also deplete three of their ultimate move gauge orbs, which is going to slow them down. So everything about this champion is going to be about stalling out your opponent, disabling attack skills, increasing the usage of yours, um, depleting them of their ultimate gauge. Everything about this champion screams amazing support character. Um, my buddies who are on the Japanese server have confirmed and showed me video footage of theirs and it is just an amazing character. It's something that everybody should be going for, hopefully if possible, right? And then he should also show up shortly in the Platinum um, coins, I believe in the next three to four weeks, if what I'm understanding is correctly on that. Um, if you have updated information on that, um, that specific piece was more like hearsay on the forums. Um, so if you have more uh, direct information on that, put that on the comments below. The last thing that we're gonna be talking about here really uh, is his unique ability, increasing all allies damage by 10% at the start of the next turn if the hero doesn't take damage. Now, it does reset upon taking damage, so you're probably not gonna get that very high very often. 
um, unless you're combining his skill with others or possibly taunting them out but it does have the possibility to ramp up your champion's damage exponentially um, i feel like he's going to be a high attack target though uh, going forward, I would definitely say that you are going to be seeing this champion on every single team um, in PvP at the very least. And uh, if you can't get him, at least hopefully you can get a buddy who does have him on their team so that you can stock, start stockpiling these for your various story. Um, so I would kind of check around, see who has one if you do not or cannot get one. Um, and if you cannot get it, I would just wait and see what's going to be happening on the uh, Platinum Coin Shop. But that is Gauther, um, the overview. And once we get him in game, we're going to be doing some gameplay videos as well. So thank you guys so much. And uh, hopefully I'll see you guys around.